Hi, so for today, we're going to talk about multiplication of binary numbers. And uh, as we all know, binary number system has a base 2, which means that the highest uh, appearing number should be, uh, if it is a base 2, it should be minus 1. Just like in our decimal system, okay, number system, we have the highest number of 9. Okay, we, the decimal system is base 10, but the highest number should be, uh, the 10 minus 1, which is 9. So from 0 to 9, that's the that's a decimal system. But for binary numbers, it has a base 2 system, meaning there can be only two digits. So that is that is composed of the zeros and 1. Okay? So we have a base 2, therefore the highest number appearing in binary, binary number system should be 2 minus 1, which is 1. So hence we have zeros and 1. So, let us take note of some of the uh, simple uh, multiplication of binary numbers. Of course, as you can see here, if we have 0 times 0, that would result to 0. 0 times 1 is 0. 1 times 0 is 0. So, if there is a 0 in the multiplicand or the multiplier, okay, the, the result should be 0. The only time that the um, result would be 1 is if they are both 1. Okay, so in multiplication of binary numbers, we will be using our knowledge on how we multiply uh, decimal numbers. Okay, and uh, we are also going to use our knowledge on upon multiplying the binary numbers, we're going to add it just as like what we are doing in the multiplication of decimal uh, system numbers. Okay, or uh, the normal numbers. Okay, so. For the first example, how do we find the uh, multiplication of the binary 1, 1 multiplied by 1, 1? Okay? So, well, of course, this is like what we are doing in decimal system. We're going to multiply this term first to this and to this and then add okay, the, the multiplication of this one and this two. So, just as like we are performing multiplication in our decimal system. Uh, system number. So, for example, if we are to multiply 73 multiplied by, uh, let's say, 12, okay? We multiply that. First, we multiply this. We have 6, 2 times 3. 2 times 7 would be 14. And then, we go to the other one, and we're going to write the result and in aligned with this one, okay? So, we have 1 times 3 would be 3. 1 times 7 would be 7. And then, we're going to add the 2. So we have 6, 4 plus 3 is 7, 1 plus 7 is 8. So 876. This same process we're going to apply to the multiplication of binary numbers. So let's try. Now for the first one, okay, we know that this would be 1 times 1 would be 1. 1 times 1 would be 1. Again. And then we go on to the second uh, number here, second uh digit here which is still 1 and we're going to align it if we are going to multiply this uh, we are going to multiply this uh, multiplicand on, on this we should align the result to this line okay so we have 1 times 1 would be 1 and again 1 times 1 would be 1 so in other words we are going to okay we're going to add these two numbers so 1 plus any other number we can refer to it as uh the void number, so bring down 1. So we have 1 plus 1 is 0, carry 1. Okay? So we will be using our knowledge again in addition of binary numbers. So what will happen? 1 plus 0 is 0, carry 1. And then 1 plus 1 is 0, and then carry 1. So we have this answer, 1001, as the uh, product of the, these two binary numbers. Okay? So let's try another example. So for number 2, we try the example binary 101 multiplied by 111. So the same process we're going to do. 1 times 1 would be 1. 1 times 0 would be 0. 1 times 1 would be 1. And then copy again, 101. Take note of the alignment. Okay? Okay? So where we multiply. So again, this 2 would be 1, 0, 1. And then we add... All. So we have bring down 1, 1 plus 0 would be 1, 1 plus 1 would be 0, carry 1, okay? Then we have 1 plus 1 is 0, K1, 
carry 1, and then 1 plus 1 will be 0, carry 1. So we have the result 1, 0, 0, 0, 1, 1 as the product of these two uh, binary numbers. Okay, so for number 3, okay, let's try a little uh, harder. Okay, so we have 1, 0, 1. 1, 1, uh, 0, multiplied by 1, 0, 1. Okay? So, what will happen here is we have 1 times 0 would be 0. 1 times 1 would be 1, 1, 1, 0, 1. We simply copy this. Okay? And we know that 0 times 0 is 0. Any number would be 0. So, we leave this space. Okay? So, this should be 0. Okay? Yeah. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, so this should be another 1, 0 here. So, again, we, we multiply it again to our 1 here. So, what will happen is that 1 times 0 would be 0. 1 times 1, again, we simply copy this whole term. Okay, But take note that we must align it here because we are now multiplying with 1. Okay, So, 0, 1, 1, 1, 0, 1. Okay? So, we add... Bring down 0, 1 plus 0 would be 1, 1 plus 0 plus 0 would be 1, 1 plus 0 plus 1 is 0, carry 1. We have 1 plus 1 again is 0, carry 1. 1 plus 1 is 0, carry 1. So, 1, 0 plus 1 is 1, carry 1. 0 plus 0 would be 0 plus 1. We have 1 and copy 1 here, bring down 1 here. So, we have the result 1, 1, 1. 0, 0, 1, 1, 0. Okay, in binary 4. Okay, so let's try again. The only way for you to, to be good in uh, multiplying uh, uh, in, in binary or in, in operation of binaries is for you to solve many problems. Okay, so as you solve many problems, you will be practiced with your skill in problem solving. So we have 1, 0, 1, 1, 1 times 1, 0. Okay. So, we know that the 0 multiplied by this would be 0, 0, 0, 0, 0. Again, we multiply this again by 1. So, we have 1, 1, 1. 1 times 0 would be 1, uh, 0. 1 times 1 would be 1. And then we add this 2. It's very easy because we have zeros here. We simply copy this. So, we have this as our answer to this multiplication. Okay, so another one is, let's try again to multiply 1, 0, 1, 1, 0, 1, 1, multiplied by 1, 0, 1, 1, 1, 0, 1, 1. Okay, let's multiply it. So first term, first, first uh, digit here. So this would be 1, 1, 0, 1, 1, 0, 1. And again, the same but shifted here, aligned here, because of this digit. So we have 1, 1, 0, 1, 1, 0, 1. And of course, this 1, 0 multiplied by this would be simply 0. So we can proceed now to this. But we would be aligning this, okay, this number in into this. Because this is aligned to this, this 1, this 1, and finally here. So we have 1, 1. 0, 1, 1, 0, 1. Okay? So, what would be the result if we add this? Okay? So, 1, 1 plus 1 is 0, carry 1. 1 plus 1 is 0, carry 1. 1 plus 1, 0, carry 1. So, 1, 0. 1, 0 plus 1 is 1, 1. Okay? 1, carry 1. Okay? So, we have 1 plus 1 is 0, carry 1. 1 plus... Uh, 1, 0 plus 1 is 1, 1, okay? So, this 2 would be 0, carry 1, so 1, 0. So, 1, 0 plus 1 is 1, 1. So, 1, 1 plus 1 is, okay, that would be, that would be 0, 0, 1. So, we have 0 here, we carry 0 here, and we carry 1 here, okay? So, we have 0 plus 0 is 0, 0 plus 1, 1 plus 0 should be 1. So, we have 1 plus 1, 0, carry 1. So, 1, 0 plus 1 is 1, carry 1. So, the same process, 1 plus 1, 0, carry 1. 1, 0 plus 1 is 1, 
1 so we have 1 here okay then 1 plus 0 is 1 and then bring down 1 here we have the answer for this problem so this is our answer to our problem okay so let's try another one okay last problem i think for this video okay let's try so we have one 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 zero one one zero one one then we have a zero one 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 multiplied by one 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 okay so the same process so what will happen since these are all one we're going to copy this but take note we have to align it on every digit we multiply so we have one 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 zero one one zero one 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 again since this is aligned to this we would align this we start with this so we have one 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 zero one one zero one 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 okay so for the third number still we start here so we have one 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 okay we have zero one one zero one 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 so we're going to add this to get the product of this so we have uh bring down one we have one okay one plus one is zero carry one one plus one zero carry one so one zero plus one would be one one again plus one so that would be one zero zero so what will happen zero zero carry one here on the other side so we have zero plus zero is zero one plus one is a zero carry one so we have one plus one zero carry one one zero plus one is one one plus one again that is one zero zero so we have zero zero carry one here so we have one plus one is zero carry one here so one plus one is zero carry one then we have four ones again so that is one zero zero so we have zero zero one and then we have zero one is one plus one is zero carry one so we have one plus one plus one plus one here four ones okay again that is one zero zero so we have zero zero carry one here then we have one plus one is zero carry one and then we have one here okay one zero plus one uh is one one so one carry one here so one plus one is zero carry one and then we have uh one zero plus one is one one then one hundred okay one zero zero i mean okay plus one that's one zero one which is we have zero here this is the one this is the zero and we have the carry one here so we have one plus one is zero carry one and then one plus one is zero carry one plus one is one one so that would be our answer okay for this number number six right so for our last number let's try again i hope you're learning so we have one zero one one zero one one multiplied by one thousand or one thousand one zero one one so sorry this is a binary so there is no thousands in here so we have one zero one one so let's try to solve so one times one would be one one zero one one zero one that's because of this one so we have a one one a zero one one a zero one that's for the second digit for the third digits doesn't matter because it would be zero so a line in here is all zeros so I, I go now to the other one digit or the, the ones here to multiply to this so take note I would start here I would align this uh, the multiplication of this binary to this binary starting here so we have a one one you have a zero one one zero one so and then we're going to add them so we have bring down one one plus one is zero carry one so we have zero carry one one plus one is again zero carry one and again one plus one is zero carry one so that's one zero 
plus 1, that is 1, carry 1 here. Okay? So we have, again, the 4, 1. So 1 plus 1, 0, carry 1. So that's 1, 0, plus 1. Again, that's 1, 1. And another 0 here, uh, plus 1 here. So that's that becomes uh, uh, 0, carry 1. So that is 0, 0, 1. So we have, again, what I'm trying to say is that we have four ones here, correct? So we have one plus one, that's a zero, one. And another one plus one here, that's a third one, that is a one, one. And another here, another one here is one. So this should be plus one. So zero, carry one, okay? And this one would be one plus one is zero, carry one, and bring down one, that is one, zero, zero. So what I'm going to do is write the first zero here, okay? Carry the second zero here on the next, uh, term, okay, and the one here. Carry the next one on the next term. So we have 0, 0 plus 1, plus 0 would be 1. So 1 plus 1, 0, carry 1, plus 1, that would be 1, carry 1. Again, this is 1, 1, so we have 1, carry 1, and then 1 plus 0 would be 1, and bring the 1 here. So this would be our answer. So that's all. So thank you so much. I hope you learned something for today's video about the basic multiplication of binary numbers. So if you are new to my YouTube channel, please don't forget to thumbs up to give this video a thumbs up. And please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. So thank you so much for listening. God bless you.